What is up guys and welcome back to the Johnny Q channel. Thanks so much for watching. Thank you for watching the channel. I'm Johnny Q. It's the day after Labor Day. Honestly, I don't know what Labor Day really is. I just know it's you take a break from working. But if you know me, I don't take a break. So let's get into it. This is 1080 and this is 4K. 1080, 4K. Which one should you vlog in? We'll answer that question. We'll answer that question right now. 4K has its limitations, 1080 has its limitations. Which one should you vlog in? So I personally only vlog in 1080p, only because most of my viewers view my YouTube videos on this device. The iPhone or Android, they don't really display 4K video. I'm gonna do it on that camera, on the 4K camera. I would want a monitor that displays 4K. So in essence, you'd want to be displaying my 4K footage on a 4K monitor. So I would suggest always be filming in 1080p unless your client says I specifically want 4k unless your client says I specifically want 4k footage for this project then you go and you get the biggest memory card there is possible and you film in 4k even even if you know they're gonna be viewing that project or video on YouTube where it's 1080 all across the board you do what you can to make it in 4k now because 4K is not really accessible to everyone on phones, that's why I choose 1080p. But what you can do is take your 4K file, your 4K footage, downgrade it into a 1080p, and inadvertently, yes, it looks better than 1080, but really, you're kind of like, it's, it's like apples and oranges. I view the 4K and 1080p debacle or debate kind of like, should I be filming in 24p or should I be filming in 60 or 30 or even 120? Don't do 120, that's... Don't, just don't do that. There's a place and purpose for 60p and there's a place and purpose for 24. I shoot all my vlogs in 24. If I wanted to do anything slow motion or more cinematic to slow it down, to make it seem more cinematic, I'll do 60 or 120 frames a second. But when it comes to putting out vlogs, video content on the internet, I usually go with 1080 and not 4K. One of the drawbacks of 4K is this. If I have 4K, if I only have 4K, I can only film for a specific amount of time because 4K eats up battery, eats up memory card. And I don't have that much storage in memory cards. Unless I got 256 gigabyte memory cards, then it would be fine. But I have 120 gigabytes. I don't wanna go through all that footage, all that memory power and actually filter through the 4K. Now it's not to say it's impossible, you can totally do it. When I first started vlogging, I used a Sony A6300 and I used 4K all of the time because I just thought 4K would be the thing. 4K is the future. All my vlogs need to be in 4K just, ha just to get really good, crystal clear footage. <sighs> but then I got to editing that footage and it just took up so much power for my computer to be editing every single frame. I couldn't actually view it in real time so I had to go down and cut in half in Premiere. It was just a whole headache and so that's when I decided, you know what, let's go to 24. It's still crystal clear in, tw wait, in not 24, I'm sorry, in 1080. It's still crystal clear in 1080p but like I said before, in order to view 4K footage like to the best it can be, you need a 4K display. I don't have a 4K display. You might not have a 4K display, and if you're gonna be watching YouTube videos, you're not gonna be hauling a huge you know, monitor to be viewing 4K, just so you have the actual uh, convenience to be, to be viewing in 4K. No one's gonna do that. Everyone hauls around one of these things, and when my YouTube video comes up, you know, most likely you'll be watching in 1080p. So if you're like me, you're always wanting like the best gear possible to be making videos. And when I first started out, again, I was using 4K. So hopefully this answered your question to 4K, 1080, what should I do? Well, hopefully now I can help you in answering that question and I get out there and go film in 1080 or 4K. Catch you next time on the Johnny Q channel. Peace.